The Saskatchewan Rough Riders are still practicing, even though CFL players voted down a deal Monday night. It sucks for everyone. Brett Lothar was a bit surprised by that vote. The Riders kicker and players rep says the Canadian-American ratio and pay raises are sticking points for some. The guys are in different stages of their career and their in lives and everything, so um, the yes or no is dependent on what they want to do. With the new offer on the table Tuesday, the clock is ticking, and should players decide to turn it down, the CFL says they'll be served notice to leave their training camp facilities. But for now... These guys want to play, and they, they love football, and that's why they're here. So I was not surprised one bit that they came out with good energy and, and good enthusiasm today. With the preseason opener against the Winnipeg Blue Bombers just a week away, Mosaic Stadium food vendors are feeling the stress. The anxiety that you get from it for sure is, uh, is something that is hard to deal with. Darren Zaruka owns Campfire Grill, which runs 45 tills across the concourse. He says the health inspections are passed and the kitchens are cleaned. They're just waiting for the thumbs up to order the food. We'll be ready. Um, you know, it'd be nice to know sooner than later and, and just really nice to, to see it happen. And Ryder fans are feeling mixed about another potential delay. I hope not. I want the season to be packed this year. Uh, Ryderville is going to be upset, so... Yeah, we don't want that to happen. If it has to happen, it has to happen. I'm not upset about it. The new deal presents CFL teams with a $1 million ratification bonus. It also reduces the number of American players who can qualify as Canadian based on years played. The Players Association now has until Thursday at midnight Eastern time to accept it. Jesse Anton, CBC News, Regina.